Hey guys, John V here from Phone Arena. Right now I'm doing a quick hands-on look at the new iBooks 2 feature. Um, it's available right now. It was announced earlier today at Apple's press conference and centers around textbooks. And as Apple likes to say, they're trying to reinvent it. So uh, rather than having a static approach, you know, you take out your textbook from your backpack, uh, it's a little bit more engaging with uh, with uh, textbooks on the iPad. It uh, offers a lot of neat content, uh, multimedia, um, interactive uh, items, and we'll quickly show you that here. So let's just launch iBooks and let's go to the store, show you the hub where you could purchase content. So you go to the uh, store here, the iTunes store, introducing textbooks. Now the neat cool thing about the textbooks on the iPad is that you know it offers multi-touch, different layouts, interactive images, 3D graphics, and a whole lot more so that you're constantly engaged, so your mind stays focused on topic on hand. Now it's uh, the, the textbooks vary uh, from for different age groups and levels, um, and they all start at $14.99. You can tell here there's very limited content right now in the store, but over the coming days, weeks, months, you'll see a lot more uh, stuff put on to the uh, to the, uh, the store here so right now we're going to show you EO Wilson's life on earth that's the textbook that's free right now it's worth noting that the the book itself the books uh, the textbooks are approximately close to one gigabyte in file size so it's pretty hefty download um, so you want to have an adequate connection to to uh, download them so the first thing you see um, when we uh, launch the uh, the book here, the textbook, let's just go back to the beginning here. Um, it actually launches a video, so I'll quickly show you this here. This is a century in which we've got to solve the great problems and make the great discoveries concerning life on this planet. I'm going to ask you to enter the world of the biologist. This, in my opinion, is an authentically revolutionary advance in science and technology education. So there you go. That's the, uh, the introduction. That's the first thing you're treated to right off the bat. So you get that, uh, you know, video commentary about the entire book. Now, at first, it's laid out in different chapters. When you're in landscape here, you have, uh, you know, it breaks down to subsections. Swipe over, you get chapter two, and of course the credits, special thanks, and whatnot. So you could go into each and every category um, by, you know, differently, whatever you want to do. So here's what it looks like when landscape. You have a lot of nice looking photos, uh, pretty good detail to them. You could interact with them if you want. To. This is a 3D model of a uh, uh, chromatin fiber, as they say. And the text itself, very legible. Of course, you could change the size of the font if you want to, the brightness, um, you know, a variety of different things right there for you. Um, and they also offer a lot of uh, interactive stuff, as we mentioned already. So, for example, this one here, you could choose uh, different levels of DNA, protein, uh, lipid compounds. And carbohydrates, and it shows you again, you know, a lot more interaction going on with it, rather than seeing at a, a seeing it as a static thing. So it gives you a better visual, you know, in your head, um, and other different types of animations. Here's another one here. So I quickly show you this guy. So you have you could do different animations. You could select them. You could tell the difference here. Here's another one, pretty neat, and you could maximize it if you want to, so you have better visibility in what what it's trying to show you here. Tap for more details, and of course, right off the bat, this is not something you typically get with a regular textbook, so it's pretty nice it offers that. Here's a three, interactive 3D uh, uh, animation here. This is pretty neat because uh, you could actually rotate it, twist it, whatever way, you get a really good look at everything, and you can tell how smooth it is. Very nice again, and some more stuff. Section 2, another video, another animation, uh, and the other neat thing is, of course, the whole uh, study cards uh, portion about this. So, for example, let's say you come across something um, that you want to remember or you want to take a note on. You could select it. You could highlight it if you want to, change the different colors. Uh, you could underline it, cancel it, delete it. And um, the other thing is you notice some of the words are in bold. So if you press it, it gives you the glossary, basically the definition. You could check the glossary index where it is in the uh, actual textbook where it comes in. So it's pretty, you know, pretty self-explanatory. Instead of going to the back of a normal book, it's right there. You don't have to leave the page. It's all available to you right off the bat. And, of course, you could also, you know, highlight we said. You could also add notes. So you just type in whatever you want. Just like that, and hit return, exit out of there. So if we go to our study cards right up here, it'll give us all the stuff that we took our notes on, which is pretty neat. So 
we go down different chapters and we can see what we what we said for this section here and the other thing is of course the study card section which is pretty nice just because you know it's like something that you'd use if you're going to test yourself so um, you know it gives you different glossary terms and if you flip it over you get the definition again great for studying and a lot of benefits and you can tell you know it just gives you everything at the, at the palm of your hand so you don't have to go elsewhere and that's pretty much it guys this is the uh, new iBooks 2 um, textbooks feature so you could check out more of the content that are available in the uh, in the iTunes store and again as we said it's going to be the amount of content is going to increase you know in the coming days weeks months and it's just nice saying that you know it offers an easy and a very attractive uh, you know layout so it makes you makes the entire experience a lot better than having to just read a bunch of text and you know fend for the information yourself you get a lot of stuff a lot of stuff uh, right off the bat, so it is pretty engaging. So if you want to learn more about iBooks, the new iBooks too, you can check out our website, guys, phonerena.com. This is John V. Thanks for watching again.